sexually assaulted her at the family's Connecticut home, an incident that's never been proved. In an open letter to the New York Times, she's renewed the accusation, claiming that she had been moved to speak out because of Hollywood's continued embrace of Alan. She accuses Alan of having led her to a dim, closet-like attic to carry out the assault. The film director was investigated on child molestation claims back in 1992 for the alleged incident, but prosecutors never charged him, and he has always maintained his innocence. Protein sport to basketball. The Perth Wildcats have ended their two-game losing streak with an 81-57 win over the Melbourne Tigers. Top place Perth scored more than 20 unanswered points in the second quarter. National weather Brisbane, possible shower in 29 degrees. Sydney, cloud clearing in 27. Canberra, sunny in 37 degrees. Melbourne, a cool change developing in 35. Hobart, showers developing in 26 degrees. Adelaide, windy, partly cloudy in 29. Perth, sunny in 32. Darwin, showers and storms and 30 degrees. This is ABC National News. A couple of observations from you on, on, on him and all of that stuff. That'll be good. All right, we'll be back with you in a few minutes. Okay, John, here we come. The problem of tsunamis in particular is that there is no warning. You are in Radio Australia. Pacific Beat. Important message for all these countries, especially the Pacific Islands that are near faults like Samoa and Tonga and Etchingham Lawrence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,